sandwiched between a rivalry series loss in Tucson and an upcoming crucial series at number 13 UCLA, ASU Baseball took a pit stop at Phoenix Municipal Stadium for a rematch with the UNLV Rebels. ASU opened the game by blinking the Rebels in the first inning, clearing the way for a leadoff home run by center fielder Joe Lampy. From there, however, it was smooth sailing for the Rebels who would score nine straight runs on 12 hits to defeat the Devils for a second time this season. Following the lopsided 9-1 loss, head coach Willie Bloomquist struggled to find anything positive to say about his team's performance Tuesday night. Everything that we preached not to do, we did. Um, taking fastballs for strikes down the middle, swinging it, it breaking balls in the dirt. Um, I mean, just it was uh, it was a very poor performance. I don't know how else to. I, I usually I always have my teams back, but to, tonight with with that effort level, it's very tough to say something positive. It just was not a not a well played game on any front. Bloomquist did manage to find something to highlight in the performances by pitchers Danny Marshall, Luke Laflamme, and Andrew Lucas, who all helped end the Sun Devils' suffering in the final three innings despite limited playing time throughout the season. Um, Danny Marshall threw the ball well for not being out there for a while. Luke Laflamme came in and got his out, and then Lucas you know, did, did very well in, in his inning of work. So um, not many positives to talk about, but um, I guess if you want to take some sort of positive, yeah, those guys did okay. ASU will look to get themselves back on track this weekend when they travel to California to face off against UCLA. Reporting for Cronkite Sports, I'm Tia Reed.